Hello, I'm George Mason, Senior Pastor of Wiltshire Baptist Church, and I'm happy to introduce you, if you haven't already been here, to the Wiltshire Columbarium. Columbarium is a, a big word for a place of rest that is somewhat like and somewhat unlike that of a cemetery. Uh, here at Wiltshire's Columbarium, we inurn remains of those who have been cremated after death, and they are placed here in niches like these, in a wall like this, also on the other side, uh, where we can see their name and remember their role in the life of our church and in the relationship to our families here at Wiltshire. People like Phil Strickland and Ed Louse are listed here, along with many other loved ones. Uh, and then also we have a memorial wall for those who have been buried in other places, but who we would like to remember also when we are able to come here. Our Beloved late pastor, Bruce McKeever, is here in this place, as is one of our uh, great missionary uh, presences, Finley Graham. Uh, th this has been a choice for many of our beloved members and their families in recent months since we have opened the columbarium. But what really is the meaning of a columbarium? You might think of it this way. In, in the country, many churches have plenty of land around them, and they have often had country churchyards or grave, graveyards right next to the church. And the idea, of course, is that a person would be buried there, and then families would be able to come to church and easily go and uh, be with the remains of the person to remember them, to honor them, to put flowers on their grave or the like, and uh, remember that they are still part of the great cloud of witnesses that is the church. Uh, just that, that now they are worshiping with the Lord, even as we are worshiping the Lord here in this body. We know that whether we are buried or uh, we are inurned in a place like this, God is able to remember who we are and at the time of the great resurrection, make us again into the people that he has raised up and reward us with the life everlasting and the resurrection body that he promises.